as she goes for her dreams. Trix Ingado, KTN News. Parents whose children were candidates in private schools have hauled uh, Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi's directive to absorb a KCPE candidates who scored over 400 marks in international schools. They say this will motivate not only the pupils, but also the teachers and parents. <laughs> Jessica Baraka and her mother Deborah Kihai continue to celebrate at their home in Tasia Estate here in Nairobi. Jessica was the top student at Tasia School where she scored 431 marks. The mother feels her daughter is steadily moving towards realizing her dream. Yes, I wanted 430, so I hit my target. I'm really hopeful that she'll get into alliance. We're moving from 408 to 418 and now 431. I'm very excited about that one, of the improvement of the school record. Inspired by the decide to beat last year's top candidate at the school and eventually hoping to become a surgeon, Jessica is one of the many top performers from private schools, optimistic of being admitted into national schools. A situation held by teachers, owners and parents of private schools who have termed the move by Dr. Fred Matiangi as the best gift ever. All our children who are 400 marks and above in national schools, regardless of whether they did the exams in private or public schools, we will not discriminate against any of our children. I'm really very grateful to the government for seeing this and not necessarily punishing the parents who take the children to private schools. There is no difference between a public child and a private child. They need to be treated equally because they, we use the same syllabus. Uh, the teachers are trained in the same uh, colleges. The situation is not any different at Happyland School in Buruburu. Top candidates joined by their teachers and parents have been gathering to celebrate and give thanks to God. Chantelle Njeri was the top student here and she hopes to join Kenya High. Schools of choice were Kenya High School, Pangani Girls and Bishop Gatimu, but I intend to go to Kenya High School. Not a single child was, was caught cheating. And uh, we are very, very happy about Matiangi and the, man uh, the other management. Education stakeholders believe the decision by government to upgrade more schools to national status may explain why Dr. Matiangi was confident in directing that all candidates who scored 400 marks and above should be placed in national schools. I want to go to Alliance High School. After that, I'll, ha I'll work hard there. And maybe I'll become an engineer. But originally, the national schools used to be 71. But then with the creation of centers of excellence, some of the centers of excellence grew up to, be, to become national schools. And that's why now we have more national schools. As he released this year's KCP results, Education CS Dr. Fred Matiangi said the performance posted by nearly a million candidates had remarkably improved. But it was the declaration that the results herald the emergence of high performance of public schools that has elicited varied opinions. Very good students are going to register in, in, in public schools and so the, the results will, will, will come up and so the competition in future may be quite uh, stiff. Teachers, parents and candidates from private schools feel the government is keen on cushioning them from discrimination against private schools. The government is working with the private schools. That is why you see even now the selection will not be for public schools. The best schools will be for private and public schools. So we are proud of our government. Our player is from our president. That's Matiangi remains in education.